Oh, that's really weird. Hold on, I'm gonna try restarting SNES 9X. Or maybe I didn't have it... Did I close the, uh, the thing here? Give me one second. I apologize. For some odd reason, SNES 9X is not up in my, uh... Xander60, thank you for following. Man, it just wouldn't be a, a return to streaming after being gone for a while if I didn't have some technical difficulty. There always has to be something. Oh boy, no, I sure don't want to share my Discord. <laughs> I almost clicked my Discord chat window. Oh yeah, guys, why don't we have a fun stream while we read all of my personal conversations? <laughs> I think that would be really fun. Can you imagine if I just like didn't care that much? <laughs> it's just like, you guys want to go over my chat history on Discord with me? Let me pull up someone I haven't talked to for a year. Let's review. <laughs> all right. There we go. There we let me get rid of my cursor there and we'll be all good to go. I guess I might have accidentally deleted my SNEX 9X feed on XSplit. I apologize. It's all right. Let's play some Earthbound. I have every gay emote. Oh yeah, I was reading about that, that Pride Month stuff. They like donate and you'll get emotes and I'm like, oh, that's dope. Um, I'm not online, like, at all. <laughs> but that's so cool. Yeah, happy Pride Month. I don't know if I ever said that on stream yet. Happy Pride Month, everybody. I hope you're all, uh, proud of being who you are. I guess... Oh, God, you guys. I don't know if you know. Uh, I appreciate the intercourse, acquaintance. Can you don't... Yosuke Hanamura's birthday is today. Alright, thanks for your time. Oh, is my volume, like, turned way up or no? Is it okay? Is it alright? It's not right. It wasn't super loud. It's okay. There's like a mic bumping sound that keeps happening. Is it this? That's probably just me hitting my laptop like a fool. Alrighty. Have you been playing Golden Mika? I played it when it was on the Vita. So no, I don't have it, and I don't really have much desire to have it on Steam. I guess I probably should. I might replay Persona 4 sometime. I have a resentment against Golden because uh, Marie really sucks and she never should have been added to the game. Oops, controversial gamer opinion. Feel free to hate me over that one. Alright, where's the place that, uh... Dalam. Yeah, that's it. Shit. I didn't think there would be a tree there. <laughs> it's true, I could stream Persona 4 Golden if I wanted to. Yosuke is 26 today. Yes, I'm well aware of that. His birth year is the same as mine. Son of a bitch. I thought there was more space there. Uh, maybe this is enough space? As cute as this is, this is also sort of annoying trying to figure out how, exactly how much space I need to do this. Alright. Are you- <laughs> Hey Mika, are you ever gonna continue playing Persona 4 Kappa? That's funny. <laughs> Didn't I like come back here just because I wanted to go to Ness's house? Oh, how cute past me. You were adorable and frustrating. Oh wait, yeah, you did start that. I sure did, like a year ago? Over a year ago? Have you thought of that one sound clip of I, if you were to replace your 69 bit alert? I don't want Seth's presence to be gone from my streams. So, if I remove the 69 bit alert now, I remove Seth's presence from my streams, and that would make me sad. So I wanna keep the 69 bit alert because it makes me think of my friend Seth, who I love very much. Feel free to clip that and send it to him if you want, guys. Or maybe I will. I can't right now, I have to play Earthbound. <laughs> if you're gonna stream Persona 4 again, Persona 4 Golden on Steam would be easier. Oh, hell yeah, it would. But the thing is, is that I don't really want to play it. <laughs> That's the issue, is that I'm like, I don't have much desire to play it. But everyone seems to keep being like, what are you gonna play Persona? Son of a bitch, this asshole in his white fucking t-shirt. <laughs> Why 
white t-shirt bitch getting the fuck in my way. Can I go this way? I bet I can do it like this way, yeah? Let's find out. White people be like, yeah, white people be like ruining my teleport, am I right? Oh well. Someone just said I think you can run in a circle and do it. I'm not sure about that one, but whatever. I did what I wanted to do, so it's fine. Eventually, I made it work. Only those who didn't play Persona 4 are getting it on Steam, I feel. I mean, yeah, for a lot of people it's been inaccessible for a while because they either didn't have a PlayStation 2, couldn't get a copy of the game, or they didn't want to buy, buy a fucking Vita just to play Persona 4, which, uh, understandable. I remember people bought a Vita just to play fucking Danganronpa, and they put that on Steam. Not that those things are necessarily comparable, but it is still true. I knew some people that are like, I have a Vita, this means I can play Persona 4 and Danganronpa. Oh, what the future holds. What is this? I used to have a Vita, um, for a while. I don't think I had- I think I had Persona 4 Golden, and I think I might have gotten, like, Parappa the Rapper on it from, like, the store. I wonder what this guy's thing is. Let's find out. You only would get HP restore when I don't need it. Oh, he's vulnerable to freeze and fire. Okay. I'm gonna warn you guys right away. This might just be like a level grindy type stream. I hope that's okay. I'm not planning for it to be too long. And I know I need to level grind. And I know some of you guys like that and some of you don't. Um, I'll try to keep it to just this stream. Yeah, Persona 4 and Teddy Bear Murder Simulator dropping on Steam killed the Vita forever. What the hell is Teddy Bear Murder Simulator? You can't just say words in a string together like that and expect me to know what you're talking about. You could just speed up the game like you did Pokemon. Yeah, but I really like Earthbound, and it kind of feels abusive to a game when I speed it up. Is that a weird thing? Should I- is it weird that I feel that way? <laughs> I feel like I'm hurting it. <laughs> I don't want to hurt Earthbound, I really love this game, even though I've never completed it. Just a reminder to anyone who doesn't know at this point, I have played Earthbound! I got to the very end of the game, and then I never did the, the final boss. So I got close, but I didn't quite complete it. These guys aren't so bad. They're pretty weird. What do I fucking keep calling Gygus? Googies, right? <laughs> because that's a, a Seth's thing I think on, on Twitch is like, say yes to Googies. So every time I see it, I'm like, say yes to Googies. <laughs> Googies. I think he spells it, don't quote me on this, G-O-O-G-I-S? Googies? <laughs> So usually it's say it's to Gygus, but it's say it's to Cookies. <laughs> I can't believe that that shimmy thing really did have a lasting impression on me. When I was making the shimmy command, I was like, you know, I really- That really did have an effect on me. Oh boy, I don't know what I'm doing. Jesus, fuck! Alright. Okay. What the- Hello? Wow. This is a, a party? What are we all doing here? What do you guys do for fun? Is this... Did I walk in on something here? What the fuck is up with the worm guy? Hello? I don't like anything I'm seeing in front of me right now. Just kill it. Please, kill all of it. Oh my gosh. It's probably a sex thing. Wait, this? What that mouth do, though? <laughs> yeah, is this like a weird, like, sex ritual? I'm sorry, there's no command for exclamation point leg. Do you need that? The shimmying? Yeah, man. The shimmy thing really did- Just cause you guys were like, shimmy, Mika, shimmy into the corner. You can do it. You can do the tent glitch. Just fucking shimmy. 
Is a man getting head and God watching? When is that not happening somewhere on this earth? Hey, is the statistic like that? At any second in the day, is someone out there, like, getting their dicks up? I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. At any point, at any given time in a day, is someone on this planet getting their dick sucked? That's my question. I'm sorry, I can never say, like, dick sucked with a straight face like that. You know? Even if I jokingly were to say, like, boy, I got my dick sucked, I can't- I have to say, boy, I got my dick sucked! Every time. This is the part where you all unsubscribe and leave my channel forever. Oh, those records restore peepees. Whoops, sorry, I didn't mean to restore your peepees. <sighs> yeah, it's fine. What's up, my man? You finally got here. This is the sixth your sanctuary location. But it's mine now. Take it from me if you dare. Bitch. My PP was restored when I heard Earthbound music. Oh God, no, no, this is look, no, no, this is no. He's got a fan, or maybe it's a cat of nine tails. The other guy's got like electricity. This is this is a sex thing, isn't it? Look at their faces. Oh God. I'm feeling all four of these children simultaneously lose their innocence, and I have to tell you, it is heartbreaking. Uh, anyway, I guess we'll, um, fight? <laughs> Die, please! I might as well spy on it, even though I have already chosen to beat the shit out of it. Oh, good! Crashing boombang? No more boombangs. Vulnerable to PSI thigh flash? And they're holding hands? Oh, I know, man, right? What the fuck am I looking at? This is like some weird wet dream shit. Hey guys, you want to know a fun fact? You know how I told you guys I always have nightmares and that's just a thing about me, but I'm so used to it that a lot of times I have a nightmare and something terrible happens, like I dream that I caught fire and I just wake up and I'm like, oh, well, that's... You know, pretty much the usual. I had a dream that I got a phone call from my job and I was promoted and I got really, really excited. And then the person on the other line was like, okay then, Emily. And I was like, my name's not Emily. And then the woman on the other line was like, oh, I'm sorry. I, I called the wrong person. You're not promoted. <laughs> At least it wasn't a dream about losing my job, but it was still <laughs> like mortifying. <laughs> also, I don't mind sharing with you guys, there's no one at my workplace named Emily, so what the fuck? Oh, nice. Do I just like... They were talking about Mimika, I'm Emily. Oh yeah? Is that how that is? Are any of these things useful? I was gonna say, I could always just have Jeff do like a healy heal. I forget what secret herb even does. Doesn't it heal status effects? Oh, Jesus. I'll just have him defend in case, I don't know. No, I'm the real Emily. Just change your name to Emily? Maybe in my, in my nightmare- oh. Okay. Okay. When I was younger, I feel like I didn't have nightmares so much. It's something that came to me in adulthood. But a lot of times when I was younger, I had dreams about, like, really mundane things. Hey, Mika, did you see the ARMS character announced for Smash? No. I've never played ARMS. Is it one of the characters who has ARMS? Whether by that you mean weapons or arms on a body. We looking at a little swirly boy? It's like a little cotton candy man. Sans had a short vision of seeing his mother when she was young. Sans's soundstone recorded the melody of the pink cloud. Oh, that's all it is, just pink cloud? It feels like one of those pink cloud montages that they, uh, they poke fun at in that one Homestar Runner cartoon. 
The noodle girl is now in Smash. Min Min. Ah, oh, that's cute. When are they gonna put me in Smash? I'll be good. I... Now... Hailing from Games Painted. New Smash. Mika. My final Smash is just crying. And everyone dies. Because my tears are so powerful. You could put your me in Smash. No, that's not powerful enough. <laughs> no, my final Smash is Clown Jobs. <laughs> clown Jobs. Speaking of which, in Animal Crossing, I'm not sure I talked about that. I, in fact, I couldn't have mentioned it on the stream I did with Andy. Uh, I have Pietro in my town, and I gave him those night vision goggles. What the fuck am I supposed to do next? I really don't know. If I go back up here, is there more nightmares? Jeff's an assist trophy and Jeff is you? Fair enough. I guess I'm in Smash in a manner of speaking, because Jeff is me, and Jeff is in Smash in a way. Go to Summers. Okay, thank you. Sorry if you said that already. Uh, the chat's very active today. You guys good? I don't mind chat being active, I'm just surprised. I'm doing fine? Glad to hear it! That's what I want to hear. I want to hear everybody's doing okay. Or if you weren't doing okay, I want to hear that the stream is cheering you up. Summer's time, baby. Oh yeah, didn't we have a whole argument about this? Fuck. I'm lonely? Don't be lonely, you're here in the chat. And if people aren't keeping you company, just... exclamation point egg and get yourself some eggs! Have you guys ever heard that joke about French? Do you guys know any French? Have you ever heard that joke that's like, why did the man go to the store and only buy one egg? Oh shit, I can't teleport to where I already am! <laughs> and, um... The guy went to the store and bought only one egg because one egg is un -uf. Like, enough. That's real funny. un -uf. I think that's how you say it. I took French one, everybody. <laughs> That's why I had no really useful phrases like je suis en ananas and uh j'ai en bicyclette. <laughs> J'aime en chat. Je voudrais... Uh... Uh... Voiture. <laughs> Omelette du fromage. There we go. Done. You can all now press... You can all pass French one now. Now talk to the sailor in the east. Alrighty. I think you mentioned this before. I started heading this way. Excuse me. I've got like... Bleh, spit in my throat. You... You told me to go this way... That there was a whole debate about that. Have you ever seen the movie Rover Dangerfield? No! Remember that the egg command, just like all the other commands, have a cooldown. So if you do it, sometimes it takes a little time for you to be able to do it again. Just like Peg, as well, has a cooldown. Is it this guy? Go to Scaraba, you need to cross the sea. However, a monster did crack and lives in the- Excuse me, oh my god! I'm so like, bleh, today. He attacks ships that pass through. Are you scared? Nah, dog. I'm okay. Only eggs can sustain me? You guys want to know something about me? I eat so many fucking eggs. You made my wife wake up. She quit talking about that serious crap. <gasps> he said the C word in an E-rated game. What year is this, Nintendo? What year does game come out? 95? You can't say the C word in a Super Nintendo game. Yeah, let's work hard. If you're courageous, get on this boat. You'll probably see the crack and experience getting seasick. Oh, sweet, dude! Awesome! Seasickness! After all, it can only cost you your life, and you got that for free. That's... true! No, actually, that's not true. Hospitals charge you a lot of money to have a kid. That's what's fucked up about it. Luck will determine the outcome of this voyage. So, do you want to sail the seas to... Yeah. We're reckless, baby! Oh man, that is my catchphrase right there! Bon voyage, bitch! 
crap is like the least potent expletive that isn't kid friendly. I know. I remember getting in trouble for saying sucks and crap when I was like nine. And me at age nine being like, shut up. Me at age nine being like, shut the fuck up. When are we gonna get attacked by the Kraken? I'm asking for a friend. You ever like play Earthbound and you're doing something and you're like, this makes me think of Yume Nikki, and then you realize that Yume Nikki was inspired by Earthbound? <laughs> oh, so this guy's getting seasick now. That's cool. How come you guys are alright? So that bald guy over there, your buddy, right? He came from Dalam? You guys meet quite the adventurers. Haha, I'm feeling much better now. <laughs> your bald head has cured my seasickness. Yes, except it's Undertale. Yeah, that too. Man, this is just like Undertale. This is just like Sans Undertale. Imagine if the photo guy showed up here, I'd shit myself. Sweet Jesus, baby delivery with insurance caused 5,000. Oh yeah, and don't even consider the fact that what if there's birth complications, you might as well just get straight fucked. Here it comes! That's a Kraken? Ooh, that is a big danger noodle. What a- Alright, I'm about to say it. It looks like something out of Yume Nikki. Which Yume Nikki was it? So I have a Yume Nikki tattoo, if you guys didn't know. Because I have a Yume Nikki tattoo, do I sort of have an Earthbound tattoo <laughs> by association? <laughs> Answer that question for me. <laughs> Mika has tattoos? I do. You got an Undertale tattoo? <laughs> No, but I fully plan to get Sans Undertale tattooed to my thigh somewhere, and that's not a joke. <laughs> I just want to get, like, Sans' face. Oh my god, no. I want to get Sans' face, like, on the side of my thigh. Shut the fuck up. Don't tell me no. <laughs> I'm gonna get a little Sans on the side of my thigh, and when I really want to, like, get someone's attention, I'll be like, Hey, hey, come here. Come here. And I'll be wearing, like, shorts, and I'll pull up my shorts on my thigh and be like, Look at this. And I'll be like, Ugh. Oh man, I wish I could do that right now. Is any tattoo artist um, who's been social distancing for like the last three months and has had no other human contact want to come to my house and tattoo Sans Undertale to my thigh? I'll pay you like 50, 60, shit dog, I'll pay you like 150 bucks. <laughs> Anyone got a tattoo gun and they want to draw Sans Undertale on my leg? Come on over. Um, anyway, so this boss fight, uh, I think I did a spy, but I was too busy thinking about my tattoo. <laughs> and, um, I didn't see what his weakness is. I have ADHD. <laughs> <laughs> Though, I, I told you guys, I told you guys, you know, I shouldn't- Oh, well. I don't have a tattoo gun, but I have a sharpie. Does that work? Do you want to give me a stick and poke of sands on your tail? I mean, I don't really care. You didn't say, what if Yume Nikki is tattooed on you? Um, it's really subtle. It's the the checkerboard pattern that's on Matosuke's sweater. Like, just the three black ones that are the top, the bottom, and the right one. It's on my wrist. So, I mean, if you guys ever see someone in public and they're like, Oh my god, are you Mika? Games were painted. Show me your wrist. And they show your their left wrist and it's not a Yume Nikki tattoo, then it's not me. You Mika games were painted and I just like flash my tattoo like, yes, bitch! Unless a bunch of people now go out there and start getting tattoos like mine, then I might be fucked. But I didn't say which way it's facing. You know, if it's, uh, like the black square is facing my hand or my shoulder. I didn't tell you that. 
Are you Mika, Raven slash Sansa's wife? Whoever! I'm sorry, when did I ever assert that I was married to Sansa Undertale? I have not- Has anyone ever referred to me that way? Bro! Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Your Twitter? Oh yeah, that's right. Didn't I- Shit. Didn't I make that picture one time? Where I put that ring on my finger, and I was like, I said yes, that I, I had it in front of my Sans plush. Oh shit, I did do that. When was that? That was a while ago. In Stardew Valley? Oh yeah, and that's why I did it, isn't it? Because I married Sans in Stardew Valley? You know, we left off on our Stardew Valley streams when I got impregnated by Sans. <laughs> I'm sorry, you ever just have words start to come out of your mouth, and then you realize that they're coming out of your mouth and you can't stop them? <laughs> <laughs> I really didn't want to string together the sentence I was impregnated by Sans today. I think I need to lie down. <laughs> Man door, hand hook, car door. There, now everything is erased. Did you come to, from Toto by ship? <sighs> Insert some joke about the song Africa. There's a scary monster in the sea. Did you beat him or did you escape? Either way, you're fantastic. Oh, thanks. I like how you didn't define the Raven's wife part. That's literally in my Twitter description, okay? It's like my job occupation is being a wife to Raven Vesperia. Uh. Yes. <laughs> Let us know if you find any scorpions! So you could say you were boned by Sans? Oh, I sure as fuck could say that. I won't, even though I just did. I'm sorry, is there a dude- uh, What? So, first of all, we all shared that one tiny bed, is what I gathered. Which is kind of cute when you imagine they're just all kids and they kind of huddled under there like it's a slumber party and they're like, hee 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 hee! <laughs> <laughs> you know how the Kappa and more friends of Mineral Town impregnates you by pointing at you and saying, you pregnant now. That's how Sans does it. Shut up. No. I also don't want to breach further into the topic of exactly how that would come about, but I disagree, and that's all I'm gonna say about it. Oh man, I am losing control of my own chat. <laughs> what a great day. Hey Mika, there isn't a single day I do not think about that like one tweet you made like last year talking about some dream in which you had Susie Game Grumps tell you to put your ass down. Like, what does it mean? Was that me? I don't remember that at all. If you have that tweet, you should tell me because I don't recall that in the slightest. Alright, cool. Is Susie from Game Room still alive? Yes? Oh shit, he's here! Oh fuck, Fuzzy Pickles Beach! Is he gonna land on a tree? Oh. Oh no, he landed on the little wall! I'm a photographic genius if I say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory, bitch. Look at the camera. Ready? Say Fuzzy Pickles. <laughs> wow, great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Fluffy cucumber? That just sounds like a cucumber that's molding. In fact, so does Fuzzy Pickles. What are your famous delicacies? Ooh, bean croquette. Malakaya soup? Kebab, yum. I hate. I don't know if you guys know this about me. Oh yeah, I started to talk about this before and then I got distracted, uh, I don't know, by tattoos or something. I hate hard boiled eggs. I like scrambled eggs, fried eggs. I hate hard-boiled eggs. I used to eat them pretty often, now I am completely sick of them, and I cannot stand them. But you'll never make it through your teen er years without a fresh egg. Might as well buy one of these. Oh, Hilda, I see your little paw. What are you doing under there? Yeah? She's hiding under my chair. Not the chair, I'm not- that I'm sitting in, she's hiding under, like, I have a- like a- what do you call it? Like a lazy chair. She's- crawled under there. 
Ooh, crystal charm, huh? I feel like I'm actually making progress, which is weird. I wasn't ready to actually make progress on this stream, even though I don't have an issue with it. I was just like, I haven't played Earthbound for a while. I feel like I'll get lost and confused and won't make any progress, and everyone will be disappointed in me, and then I'll be disappointed in myself. But it didn't work out that way, so that's really cheering me up. Do I need any of this other stuff? What did the piggy nose do? Well, should I just buy it? What is it for? Will I need this? Hold up, I gotta see it. I have plenty of money, so it's not like that's the problem. I would be inferior to everyone here if not for the fact that I know how to progress the game's plot. Aw, oh, babe, you don't gotta be here. At least you find tr trooms later in the game? What, like, uh, like truffles? Or am I just not reading that right because it's cut off a little bit? I'm sorry, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons because I'm a fool. Alright. I'm gonna look at the item description anyway just because I'm curious. Piggy nose. If you wear this on your nose, you can find a root out magic truffles. I said truffles. I'm sorry. It got covered up a bit by the tag. Isn't Troom Troom that one weird YouTube channel that's kind of like five minute crafts except on drugs? It's always like the girl wants to cut her hair, but she can't because she doesn't have scissors. Oh well, just use this aloe leaf. You have a mark of bad luck on your face. No, don't worry. If you want to know, I'll humbly tell you. You shall come back here after you've encountered a dangerous situation. Okay, thanks. No, I don't want your fucking seasonings. They just take up my inventory space so I can heal five more HP. I'm good. Thank you very much. I'm a red snake. Come on in. Kiss of fire armpit hair fertilizer. Yes. I can buy a snake? Careful, snake. And a viper? Yeah, I want those. I want a snake. This dude just straight up set vial of serum. Yeah, I want that. I don't know what for, but I need it right now. Snake does some damage, I think. Oh, I should probably give that to Jeff then. Cause he's, uh... Well, he's Jeff. Y'all are all carrying way too much stuff. Maybe I should try selling things. Careful, snake. What the hell do I need with any of- I still have the trout yogurt. Can I get rid of that? <sighs> if I request to get rid of the trout yogurt, are you guys all gonna be like, No, Mika! It's like the Franklin badge! You can't get rid of the trout yogurt, Mika! No! No! I'm gonna go find a telephone. Eat it? You can eat it? Can you? Oh, this seems like it might be a waste. Trout yogurt has no purpose anymore. Eat it. Fuck it. Tangy ate it. Oh, it just heals HP. Okay. That's fine. What does sudden guts bill do? It doubles your guts during battle. After a battle, your guts return to normal. Guts after one use. I know it says gone, but just shh. This is like one of those equipables I'm not using, isn't it? Yeah can get rid of that. Well, I'm gonna put it in storage, because I'm weird. <sighs> Is there anything else I don't need? I know I can't get rid of the Franklin badge, y'all crap yourselves. Understandably so. Wait, what do I do with these fucking snakes? Snake. When used during battle, it bites the enemy and disappears. It may also poison the enemy. <laughs> what about the viper? When used during battle, it bites the enemy and disappears. It always poisons the enemy. Oh, dope. I should give a whole bunch of snakes to Jeff. <laughs> Jeff just marching in the battle with a fuck pile of snakes, like, ah, ah, Why can't I just use my ray gun? What is- do I don't need this anymore, do I? Oh, eh, 
Do I still need this? What? You ever just want to turn your friend into a dragon? <laughs> if you sprinkle this on your friend, they turn into a dragon. Don't worry about it. I appreciate the intercourse, acquaintance. The Great Neutralizer. 69 bits. When used during battle, this item resets all the abilities of all creatures to their normal levels. Oh. Cool. Multi-bottle multi -bottle rockets actually do more damage than Dragonite, I think. Oh, weird. The Great Neutralizer is my name now? No the fuck it ain't. This is the best thing to take when you get poisoned. Aw, oh, thanks! And he's just got- I know what he's got. Uh, maybe I'll just make, like, poo handle them? Just because Jeff's carrying so much shit? Here, you can have this. And this. Mika, how good are you at Smash? Terrible! Just awful. And not really that willing to learn. Thank you for your time. Aw <laughs> oh, man, I have a stomach ache. It's fine though. I was actually on the fence about streaming today. Because with health problems I haven't been feeling so hot. But I was like, I feel good enough. I want to do it. I'm gonna do it. Hoo boy. I should put the piggy nose in storage for now. What is the Bracer of Kings? How did I miss that? To be equipped on Kappa's arm helps protect from being hypnotized and luck goes up. Oh. Oh. Oh! He has nothing! He has nothing! Oh, he has to have it like in his inventory, I'm assuming. Mika, do you like Smash Bros? Oh yeah, I like Smash Bros. I like playing it. I'm just shit at it. The Piggy Nose only has good, uh, good use and deep darkness. That's such an ominous phrase, even though I get what you're saying. <laughs> the Piggy Nose only has use and deep darkness. Use it well. Andy's competing for power again. Is Andy streaming? Asian Andy 94 is live with Ooga Booga. Is he streaming Persona 5? Or is it something else related to Ooga Booga? Let me store some stuff. Oh shit! Uh oh. Well then. Not you. Him. Yes. You are wearing one thing. Way to go. I didn't get a notice, so maybe he bow to start. Boy, he bow to do it. Anyway, what other shit do I have? I still have the hand aid! <laughs> I think I had that in my inventory forever and never used it. I guess I should just sell some of my extra stuff at this point. Persunga Bunga 5. You don't really need the town map. No, I need it. I need it. I'm gonna ask you a really serious question and I want you to not make fun of me. Oh shit, no, this guy doesn't buy stuff. If I sell the map... Hey Mika, would it be cool if I asked you more One Piece questions? Go right ahead! I think I learned some stuff about One Piece recently. Except maybe I backwards learned it. Uh, oh wait, the handbag strap, I don't want that. Oops, not that. Ah, uh, coin of silence, I don't need that. Ah, shit, it's worth like a thousand bucks? What is the name of Usopp's hometown? Usopp was born? 
Dude just looks like he just fucking phased into existence one day. <laughs> I, I fail to believe that thing was ever a child. <laughs> he can't have a hometown if he was never born. <laughs> God! Was Usopp created like in a tube? He's got that weird face. Trying to figure out what else I wanted to get rid of. The Franklin badge, obviously. Um, uh, maybe that's it. What is the name of Nami's hometown? I don't know, Big Boob City? The very last city where the grass is green and the girls are pretty? Oh, won't you please take me home? What would you call the place he phased into existence, Mika? Uh, not the ocean. <laughs> I think. <laughs> they spend a lot of time on the ocean. I'm aware of that. But he was somewhere where the ocean is not. Uh, maybe he's from, like, France? No, wait. I bet that other guy's from France. The French-looking one with the Japanese name. Uh, maybe he's from Canada. Usopp kind of seems like he would be from Canada. Doesn't Usopp have a slingshot? Isn't that, like, one of his things? I'm gonna get some of that stuff. What do we got here? A bunch of shit. I'll take a hamburger. <laughs> Rose prom rust promoter. For when you need to promote rust. Jesus Christ, why did I save any of this? Oh, a couple life noodles! Why did I store that? Oh, that's awesome! I had a spray of parsley in Pizza?! Fuck yeah! Oh, God, yes! Ho 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 ho! Who? What is the name of the continent in One Piece? Uh, Pangaea. Next question. Pangaea? Pangaea. Next question. <laughs> Land. <laughs> yeah, I got the things. Wait, what does the grand line refer to again in one piece? <laughs> oh my fucking god! <laughs> Eggs. I've got to tell you right now, that is randomly generated. It randomly generates a number between 1 and 100. <laughs> you generated 69 eggs. I appreciate eggs. the intercourse, acquaintance. Okay, yeah, you know what? Just for today, you are a comedy god. Oh wait, that was Quaint! Hey Quaint, thanks for the 69 bits. Now get 69 eggs. <laughs> oh my god! I appreciate the intercourse, acquaintance. Haha, <laughs> nice is right. Dollar dollars are acceptable. <laughs> yeah, me too. Dollar dollars are always acceptable. What is your merchandise? Flit towel. I probably need that, yeah? Who wants to hold this wet towel? You do. <clears throat> Vit towel. Grand line is a straight I line of the ocean. Acquaintance. This is for me smiting a gnome in a wooden chair in D&D &D tonight. How does that correlate? You smiting a gnome equals give me 69 bits? Why don't you buy me a house while you're at it? Uh... Banana? Yeah, I need a banana. I definitely need a banana. May you never find rocks in your sandals? Ugh. A man who truly looks out for us. Glan Line is a straight line of ocean that wraps around the world where the islands are magnetized and shit is a lot more dangerous. Why would you want to go there? I recently made a friend. He used to be a dungeon maker and now he's a dungeon man. Would you like to meet him? Oh fuck yeah, I want to meet a dungeon man. Alrighty then, I'll give you the keys so you can enter him. Uh. Oh? Oh no, I don't have it. I must have lost it somewhere. I'm sorry. I don't worry about small things. Because that's where the one piece may be. 
But we don't have confirmation that the One Piece is in the Grand Line, is this correct? We're just going in a straight line looking for a One Piece in a Grand Line? That's what- that's what, what's going on? No, I don't want any mummy bandages. No soliciting allowed, please. I didn't sell you nothing! Yeah yo, yeah yo. Am I allowed- oh, is this the hospital? Yeah, go fuck yourself. Am I allowed to play the One Piece opening on stream? Oh man, I'm so thirsty. I need to go get a drink. Fuck, man. I was just wondering what this one said. Is this guy gotta save his camel? Go to the pyramid? Why should I go to the pyramid? I don't know why I'm here. This guy looks like he's wearing footy pajamas. The way that it works is that navigation is fucked in the Grand Line, so you need a log pose- A what? To map your way from the island to island. You stay on an island till the post points to the next one. Most recent One Piece arc definitely confirms it is an, on an island at the end of the Grand Line. Listen, I don't even want to talk about the fact that series is long as shit and they don't even fucking know. Log pose is a weird compass. You're a weird c A chubby kid did his business out here somewhere? Ew! Is Pokey's poop out here? Oh no, is this Pokey's poop? Is- Sir, please tell me, is this his poop? Oh no. It's Pokey's poopy. We're looking at Pokey's poopy. Great. What a fun, quirky game. The Tenda tribe used to live here. They went to the back of the deep darkness as they were too innocent. I wonder if they're still alive. You can't just say words at me and expect me to be like, Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I've never seen you around here. What do you want? I don't have anything you would want. This is where I search your house to see if you have anything I would want. What is the name of the floating island in One Piece? Uh... Angel Island. Am I right? <laughs> Born on an island in the heavens. Oh, I already talked to this fucking guy. Skypia? When you enter Skypia, is it like do 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 That's my impression of the Skype ringing noise. <laughs> Does anyone still use Skype? Why don't you ask me questions? Like, about what I'm supposed to be doing? Uh, because I was still kind of exploring, but if you want to tell me just what you do, go ahead. I don't care about- okay, yeah. This guy just explained what the pig nose does that I already- already asked about and then found out what it does. Okay, should I just walk to the pyramid? No, why not? Yo ho ho, we took a bite of gum gum. If you use Skype in 2020, you deserve a veteran's discount. My workplace was using it for quite a while, but now is not, so... I'm probably gonna need more of these wet towels, huh? What's up, my man? I sell water to those who are thirsty. It's expensive, though. Jesus, it is. I want one. Hey, Mika, what's the name of Luffy's pirate crew? Ah, oh, fuck. We totally talked about this and I forget. The Luffy crew. The boys. The pirate boys. Aw, oh, fuck, this is so cool. Yes, absolutely take my picture here. For once, I'm okay with this. Straw hat pirates? Oh, I'm stupid. They're pirates with hats. Picture's taken instantaneously in my photograph. Wait, does anybody but Luffy wear a hat? Let me think about this. Luffy has a hat. Zolo does not have a hat. Nami does not have a hat. Uh, Sanji does not have a hat. What the fuck, guys? 
How many of them wear pirate? How many of them wear hats? Usopp's got a weird bandana thing. That's not a fucking hat. They're the straw hats because Luffy has a straw hat. He might as well have just called them Luffy and the Luffys. Self-centered bastard. Robin sometimes wears a hat. Joy. Chopper? <gasps> Chopper does wear a hat! It's not a straw hat though, isn't it? Isn't it like a straw? Or not a straw. A, like a top hat? What the fuck? Neat. I must learn this pattern somewhere, so I'll ignore this for now. <laughs> Ooh, there's a bunch of little spacey shippy guys. Oh, 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 oh! Chopper has a top hat and then a weird sphere hat. But never a straw hat, huh? <laughs> this is a good place to farm? Huh. Yeah, make a pentagram star? Oh, that's spooky. Wait, how was I supposed to figure that out? Does someone tell you? I won't worry about it. Oh. I have to do like... Wait, I'm doing this wrong. Oops. Hey Mika, yes? I'm trying to visualize what I just did. How would I go? Top one? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Shit, dog! Oh, so this thing is talking. Oh. Is... Is he supposed to look like that? He looks like he's made of Play-Doh. To the fierce shattered man. <laughs> Me? <laughs> I too am a fierce shattered man. On the inside. Let's spy on him. Oh, good. A mummy wrap that I don't really want. Should I kill him with a snake? Do I have anything useful? Snake! Ah, oh, shit, he got poisoned! Hey, what's the name of Chopper's home island? I don't know, Reindeer. Deer and Rain? Big snow. Chopper's home island is the big snow. Drum island? Same thing, right? What is this? No problem here? But there's like a, a dog holding a fish hook. I won't worry about it. Love every time this game is like, no problem here, yes problem here, pretty much always. Ants! 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 Dude on the wall just vibing? True, I shouldn't be too judgmental. Oh man, you guys, that reminds me what I was doing while I was very sad. Um, I played Pokemon, uh, Sword. Uh, the DLC came out. I don't know if you guys have been playing it. I played some of the DLC and then had a fucking nervous attack about how I haven't completed the Pokedex. And so then I started working on doing that. And I was getting all the Pokemon I don't have. And I recently got the Vibe Check Pokemon, so that was cool. Hey Mika, what's the capital of e Ecuador? 
this ass baby? Oh fuck, he's truly just five. Oh, oh, oh my god! Oh, who? Why don't I remember this? Why don't I remember this about Earthbound? Aw, oh, he's kind of cute. He looks enlightened, unlike he's standing in a pool of his own blood. I hate Earthbound sometimes. I will pray. It just seems like the right thing to do. Oh, I love when a hieroglyph makes me feel a little strange. Son of a bitch! Okay. Hey Mika, what episode is the first sex scene occur in One Piece? There's no fucking sex scene in One Piece. Shut up. <laughs> Nobody be fucking in One Piece. I don't even think- do any of those characters- is there even a character, like a living character, who has a living, breathing child in One Piece? Ain't nobody. Ain't nobody. Oh shit. Shit 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 shit! Well, it's too late. Well. Oh, I have life noodles! It's fine. What does having children have to do with sex? Uh, if a character has a biological child, that's kind of proof that they fuck. They be fucking, you know? That's that's the idea, is that, like, have any of the characters even had any sex? Well, if one of them has a living, breathing child, a biological child, then, you know, that means they fuck. <laughs> so, that was my thought process with it! Goofy fucks, never forget. Can we not? Not today. <laughs> today is not we're gonna discuss. Today is not the day we're discuss that goofy fucks. Oh gosh. Real? Pete too. Oh yeah, Pete absolutely fucks. That's out of the question. You you already knew in your hearts. You knew that Pete fucks. Ta-da! There's a viper inside! <laughs> and we just took it! Hey Mika, what is the name of Gecko Moria's island boat? I'd prefer not to think about it. <laughs> uh... Big... Big. That's the name of it. Thriller bark? That sounds delicious. Is it like, uh, almond bark? This one was just like, really dude, you're just gonna avoid me? Yeah. Yeah. That's true, Sora of Kingdom Hearts has a mom. I remember she has one spoken line that's like, Sora, dinner's ready. And then she dies or something. Bye-bye. <laughs> I forgot he had a mom, holy shit. I I think I told you guys the story about when I first had my PlayStation 2. For like a couple months I had no memory card, and I was replaying the beginnings of a couple of games over and over until I got a memory card. Life's hard sometimes. Um, I replayed the beginning of Kingdom Hearts like a million times, so I definitely remember that that was a thing. I want to replay Kingdom Hearts. Probably not for stream, though. Um, it didn't age super duper well. Here's a secret, guys. I am Sora Kingdom Hearts' mom. Destiny Islands is pretty great, though. It was. You forgot the line, Sora? Right, she says, Sora, dinner's ready. 
Sora, and then that's it. That's all she says. Um, there's yes problem here. Why can't I do anything? Hello? Who are you talking to? Who the fuck does it look like I'm talking to? The casket seems a little suspicious. You don't say. Can I, like, show him something? Don't need to just vibe? Alright. Hey Mika, what's the name of the final boss in Kingdom Hearts 1? Say it, say it, Do I not remember correctly? Ansem. No, it's Ansem, right? Shit. Wrong, that's two. Yeah, fuck. <laughs> Listen. It is Ansem. Listen, it's fucking Kingdom Hearts. It all is just one big mess in my mind. <laughs> do I have anything else for healing stat- What does the rock candy do? Does it just restore HP? Oh. Okay, weird. It was Ansem who was actually Xehanort, but sexy. <laughs> hey Mika, what is the name of Skeleton One Piece? Oh, that guy! The big guy? Mr. Bones. I have no idea. <laughs> There's Mr. Bones! <laughs> I, I really, I don't remember. Oh fuck, we all out of peepees, ain't we? Sans Undertale. Yeah, that's the one. Sans! Remember when Sansom turned into a sexy meat boat? Yeah, same. I too am a sexy meat boat. His name is Brooke. Oh! I forgot. See, when you said Brooke earlier in the chat, I thought you were just talking about a brook like water. And I was like, what, what do we have to say about brooks of water? Have you guys ever known someone named Brooke? That's like a pretty common name, yeah? Oh, there's another sh shattered meat man! Now named Brooke's Devil Fruit. The- the bony fruit. He- he took a bite of the bony fruit. And it... Broke all of his bones. And then... They bones again. They became bones again. Can the praying ever restore PP? I don't think it can, can it? What's the name of the keyblade that shows Sora's bond to Riku? <sighs> Bro, do I look like a Kingdom Hearts expert? I don't know if you ever got this feeling I am. If anything, you should ask Fred. Fred might know. I know someone who has it as a middle name. That's good enough. It seems like it would be kind of a middle name kind of name, huh? Like Marie? Marie is like this exceedingly common middle name. It's always like, what do we want to name our daughter? Uh, Sarah. What about her middle name? Uh, Marie. <laughs> it's just easy. It, it sounds good with a lot of things. Son of a bitch. Oh. Don't you be coming at me right now be like, See me go, the Franklin badge is important. God, we go. Can I use the mummy wrap on the sky? Brooks Devil Fruit is the revive, revive fruit. I shouldn't be surprised by that. This background's kind of an eyesore. Most of them are kind of an eyesore. Revive, revive fruit is such a bad name. You're telling me. In the Japanese, is it like Daibaibu, Daibaibu, or something? Because that doesn't sound- Because sometimes things sound bad in English, but they sound pretty good in, like, the katakana speak, as I like to call it. But that doesn't really sound like it would be any better. And I really want to get out of here, actually. Because now I want to just restore. I like how everything in this dungeon is like shaded with red, so everything looks like it's sitting in a pool of its own blood. Yeah, that's really nice. 
Can I use a snake on this snake? What is the name of Robin's Devil Fruit? Booby Fruit? In Japanese, it's Yomi Yomi no Mi. Yeah, that does sound better. It sounded like the kind of thing they might write in, like, katakana speak to sound cool. You know, like, insert English words. But I'm relieved to find that that's not the case, because that sounds a lot better. It's the flower flower fruit. Aww, that sounds so nice. We're all dying. In a tomb. Oh, this is a good sign. What does the flower flower fruit do? I don't know, can she like, do flower things with it? Perhaps? Perhaps she can do- it's hands? Excuse me? <laughs> oh, does anyone really need healing? I just need peepees. Does the bottle of water only work on poo? Or does it work on other people too? I seem to remember people saying... Something. Oh. Mmm, rice rule. She can grow body parts out of any surface, mostly limbs. Cool! I want to be able to do that. Ah, oh, that's kind of fucked. Yeah, I love it. She can generate infinite amounts of limbs? That just makes me think of the Ariel Needs Legs comic. You know, when she gets like eight legs. Because Ursula's like, it's eight, right? And then she's got like eight legs. And then Prince Eric is like, I don't know, man, uh, Grimsby, what do I do? She's got eight legs, and he's like, seven vaginas. You know. Infinite toes? Do you really have to put it that way? <laughs> Hooray! I restored one pee-pee! We're saved! What does the Kraken soup do? Power boost? One PP. Great. It was a waste. Neil Cicerega made that comic? I actually was about to mention that. I was like, do you guys know who made that comic? Hoo-hoo! Ariel needs legs. Classic. Such a funny fucking comic. He made everything true. Our god is an awesome god he reigns. Did you hear about Crash 4? What about the other three crashes? What is going on with this guy? He looks like Bonzi Buddy after like a 10 step program. And a skin disease. Not enough PP. Wait. Oh, it's 40. I'll do this. Do 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 do. Do. Can we play the Awesome God remix on stream? Probably not. Ooh, when you come out swinging? That sounds metal as hell. Oh, Robin creating things out of things? Where is he going? Oh here, yeah, I'll use the viper. And another viper? <laughs> Pharaoh's curse. What is the name of Joseph Joestar's stand? Hermit Purple? Why are you asking me this? <laughs> that doesn't have anything to do with One Piece! <laughs> I know about Jojo! <laughs> It's not funny if it's something I know about. I wanted to mix it up. Oh. Well, that was a fun fight, I guess. 
Yippee! Oh, baby! Oh, fuck, when you realize the power of thunder? Alright, this is not a prize. There's more enemies in here! What is the name of Gecko Mario's double fruit and what does it do? Well, he's big, so I just assume it makes you big. Um, and ugly. <laughs> Why does that sound like some sort of weird meme format? It's like a picture of like a durian and it's just like fruit that makes you big and ugly and then people like scrambling over it for some reason. <laughs> no problem here? You sure about that? I didn't realize that was an enemy. Oh god, there's two of them! Oh boy! Uh... What do we do? What do I do? Viper! Yes! And... No? Mummy wrap. And... Get him with the banana! Wait, that's not what I meant to do. Get him with the mummy wrap. Get him with the... You know what, just attack him. It's the Shadow Shadow Fruit. He controls shadows. He can cut off your shadow with giant scissors. If that happens, you'll disintegrate in the sunlight. Oh! That's... good. Did he just get killed by the poison and not the actual attack? I see. Ha! <laughs> Stupid. We all are just like out of things here. Can Pooh do like- oh, you can do that, sure. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah! What is the name of Ichirin Kumoi's big friend? Me. It's me. I... what? I don't know what just happened. I need to, like, heal up. I wish it was easy for me to go all the way back. He can also put the shadows into corpses to turn them into zombie soldiers. The fuck, man? Oh, I've had enough of this. What is the name of Cyborg in One Piece? The Cyborg. <laughs> I don't- Cyborg from Teen Titans, remember when he was in One Piece? That would be the crossover no one asked for. Well, there's probably like one person out there that is like, FINALLY THE CROSSOVER OF MY DREAMS! <laughs> Teen Titans in One Piece! I don't know, man. There's potential there. I know something about Teen Titans and don't know anything about One Piece, therefore there's potential there. Frankie? I know Frankie! He's big! And he's got blue hair and muscles and his body is like... It's like... It's like you could stick him into the top of a soda lid. But then the top half is like really big! I've had enough of this shit. Please. I just want to go heal and get some more items. Please, no more ants. 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 Oh my god. Oh my god. I also feel the pain from the poison. I don't know what is- what even started this thing in Earthbound where now everyone wants to test my- what's the name of Frankie's hometown? You just asked maybe? I don't know. 
Frankie's got like the weird jaw too, right? Yeah, it's Water 7. What happened to the other six? <laughs> His hometown is called Water 7? What happened to the other six? Where is Big Mama from in One Piece? Wait, who's Big Mama? <laughs> is that me? Yeah, Frankie's got like a three-pronged jaw. What the fuck? Yeah, is that okay? You ever just a big mom? Big mommy. Since your team is poisoned, which Toho character can control poison? I have no idea. Suika? No clue! I really don't want to do this. Just run away. Shit, dog. I think I started this trend of just asking One Piece questions, mostly me. It is something cool to talk about. That's fine. Just die. Wrong, the answer was medicine melancholy. Who the fuck? Have you guys completed the, uh, I'm sorry, this is a complete subject change, but I'm just thinking about the Pokemon I was playing this weekend. Have you guys completed the Galar decks in Pokemon Sword or Shield, depending on which one you have? I guess it doesn't matter, because the decks is the same. I have, like, 200 and... What did I leave off when I finished? I want to say, like, 220. So, I'm not even close yet, but... I guess I could have, uh, Paula pray and see if that does anything just to get us through here. I finished it, yeah? Oh man. I found a shiny Blissey on accident. Oh man, that was actually part of my thing is that I was like, ah oh, man, before I get into the DLC island and everything, I want to be able to get the, what do they call it, the shiny badge or the shiny tag? And you have to complete the Pokedex. <sighs> you bet your sweet ass my condition is critical, critically sexy. Just kidding, I'm dying. In the desert. Shiny charm, yeah, that. <laughs> wow. Shit. You ever just sneeze and take damage? What is the name of Wap Wapool's devil fruit? Who? It's just Paula now. Son of a bitch. It's fine if I just die, so I'm like, I don't... That's fine. Oh. Well... I just want to go back and heal. Am I just gonna die, like, right before I even make it? Cause that's fine. Wapol's devil fruit is the munch munch fruit. He can eat anything and turn his body into whatever he eats. Alright. So here's another thing I don't know. My Hero Academia? Isn't there a character from that that does like- Oh shit, I have to go to the hospital first. No, 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 no. Well, Tangy has a cold, so isn't she gonna die in like two seconds? What if she heals herself? Did Mika do what she needed to do in the pyramid? No, I did not. You're going to die before you reach the hospital. Nah, I'm fine. It's fine, right? <laughs> Here we go. There we go. And we just... 
Yeah! Check that shit out! We'll make it to the hospital! Hooray! Which one of these buildings is the hospital? It's this one! That I accidentally exited right away. There's a character in My Hero Academia named Seraphane who generates tape from his elbows. Isn't there one guy who like eats food and then becomes the food? In My Hero? That's another thing you can go ahead and ask me all about. My Hero Academia. I don't know shit! I've never seen an episode of it. I know that they're kids and superheroes, also adults are there, and they like go to school and they all have quirks and powers that are wacky. Uh, there's a girl who is like the zero gravity girl with the like bobbed brown hair and she's really cute. And um, the main character has green hair and freckles. I, I think- Ah oh, fuck! Fix the broken tube! Gorsh! I did it, kids. We lived through that. Yes, I do know Fat Gum. Um, I was on Etsy and I got recommended a Daki Makara, and if you're not familiar with the term, it means body pillow of Fat Gum. And I was like, aren't they all teenagers? I don't know if Fat Gum is a teenager, and I was like, oh, that's weird. To be fair, it wasn't sexual, he was just kind of on it. Where does Space Danny and his crew hang out at most of the time? Space? Doesn't he like a titty bar? I've never seen Space Dandy either. I don't need any of this. Fat Gum is an adult? Ah, oh, okay. Carry on then. <laughs> Go ahead and fuck a Ducky Mocker of Fat Gum if you want then. It's fine. What is the worst arc in One Piece? Ah, oh, fuck. Wait, did I buy two of those? I thought- oh, shoot. But I can just put snakes in it. Neat. It's called boobies. Oh, isn't that right? I don't really want any of this. I'm sorry, y'all. I got distracted because I heard a weird noise outside. <laughs> so I just completely was like, uh... But I think I'm okay. Long Ring Long Land Arc. That's the worst arc. What on earth is that? Anyway, I actually do want more of these. Can I put them in my snake bag? Oh. I thought the point was that I put, put snakes in it. No? I misunderstood the point of the snake bag. Apparently I thought it was a bag for snakes! Apparently I was wrong. Uh, isn't there anybody who sells things that heal, like, status effects? What the fuck? Do you just sell, like, food? It's not really what I need. That's not useful. Well, this sucks, donkey balls. I just want more stuff. Wait, what is this building again? Oh. Dollar dollar's acceptable. Yes, I want this for sure. Oh, 
wish I didn't have to buy things one thing at a time as well. Ow. Oh, my back hurts. My body hurts. My ass hurts. You ever just pick up a novel and then halfway through you're told it's a book in the middle of a series because the pro tag of the first book shows up and starts talking about shit you haven't heard of? I shouldn't have been a library assistant. I've definitely had that experience. I can't name in particular. I had where, like, a family member bought me a book and was like, here, I thought you would like this book, and it turns out it's, like, part four in a 16-part series, and I'm like, okay... There was some manga I got once where I got, like, book two from somebody and I didn't have book one. And I was like, uh, thanks. I wanted book one first, but that's cool. You should look up a picture of Foxy from One Piece. He's even fuckier than Gecko Moria. Alright, you know what? I will interrupt the stream. <laughs> to look up Foxy from One Piece. Foxy One Piece. The first thing that comes up is Foxy One Piece Laugh. Which makes me- What the hell? No. You can't be serious. This is someone's like weird fan- What does he have coming out of his pants? Hold up. Hold the fuck up. His laugh is fee 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 fee. Okay. Alrighty. So this is, uh... Has he got a stick in his pants? What do you think his devil fruit is? Hellspawn, hellspawn fruit. You eat it and you become the worst thing alive. <laughs> he looks like Waluigi. That... He's like top half Waluigi, bottom half Wario, all drugs. And he has an ugly coat. And for some reason, has abs, but no pecs. That's what they call me, man. Double A. All abs. The fuck am I looking at? I don't- I don't want to see that ever again. <laughs> if I can avoid it, I would never like to see him again. I don't think I want any of this other stuff. I guess a vial of serum? His devil fruit is the slow, slow fruit. He shoots a beam that slows shit down. Damn, I wish I had that. And then I would slow down my own brain. He looks like overweight Waluigi that became a bimp. Okay, maybe he's overweight, but he has abs. So he works out, I guess. He's like fit fat. That's a thing. People can be fit fat. Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna go get some more of that deluxe water. Wario also works out. Oh yeah, Wario's definitely like fit fat. Why is the hint man here? Yeah, sure. Have a hundred dollars. Cool! Yes, I literally already knew that. <laughs> oh well. Hundred dollars well spent, am I right guys? I was gonna see if there's anything over there and there's not. Usually the muscles are not pronounced like that, so he just has really fat thighs. Fuck yeah, that's the way to be. Big big muscles, bigger thighs, am I right, ladies? Ow, my back hurts! I haven't had shoulder pain in a long time, and guess what I've got right now? Shoulder pain! I need, like, a massage, and also for someone to, like... Fill me with boat and reverse hurdy juice. And ailment cure. And just, like, inject me with, like, kale and super fruits. Thick thighs save lives. True. Am I right, gamers? I think it was a good buy. You know what else is a good buy? Me walking away from you. Okay. Oh, 
hope I don't have to go to the doctor again. Can you all send me good health vibes? I would greatly appreciate it. Haha, <laughs> I've shoulder pain just by standing. Please help me. My mom thinks I'm just being whiny even though it's been 10 years. I absolutely get you. I get shoulder pain just from sitting. In no matter what position. I just get shoulder pain. So, I completely understand where you're coming from. Oh shit, dog. I definitely overkilled that guy. Health, vi health vibes beam! Thank you. Oh my god. I know I need to go into that top left room. How do I send health vibe? I don't know. Does spam like a really cool emote? <laughs> Tell me you're sending me good health vibes, and I'll be like, yes, I feel it. I'm feeling the good health vibes. Oh, you ever just get feel the pain from the poison? You ever just feel the pain of the poison? Alright, let's heal that poison. Don't you have, like, an herb or a... Don't I have a vial? Yeah, there we go. Yes! Oh, shit, dog! Wait, okay, so I haven't been here. So shouldn't I check out what's up here first? Before I go check out that hole? Hold on, I'm gonna adjust the way I'm sitting. So that maybe my shoulder won't hurt so bad. I'm surprised Hilda hasn't been talking. I've been real loud, and usually, if I'm talking a lot, she comes over and expresses her disc- Sleepy. My back is coated in acne and has gone to the point where laying down or having my back touch goes from being highly uncomfortable to generally painful. I'm sorry about that, friend. Um... They have special soaps and things for, like, bodily acne rather than for the face. I don't really get that anymore, but I used to get some acne on my back when I was younger. Hey Mika, what's the name of Chopper's Drugs? That's an excellent question, my friend. I guess he is, like, a medic, right? So he has drugs? I hope they're good drugs. Hold on, I'm getting another pillow so I can hopefully support my neck and therefore not have shoulder pain. They're combat drugs? Oh. Uh. He changes form when he takes them. Yeah, doesn't he turn, like, buff? That's really weird. <laughs> That's really weird. Can you guys hear me okay or do I need to move my microphone too? I can move it. Hold up. Is this better? Worse? Can you hear me better or worse? I'm adjusting the way I'm sitting so that I can be comfortable. <laughs> Mika, I wish you the health that's high quality. I appreciate that. I do need the high quality health. Ouchie. Should be. Chopper has... C Chopper can turn... Buff naturally. He has three forms. Reindeer buff... Reindeer, comma, buff, comma, and tiny reindeer. Rumble ball gives him other forms. Uh-huh. <laughs> Every time I hear you guys inform me things about One Piece, I always wonder if, like, you guys could tell me, like, some absolute fake bullshit. That would be a fun game to play. You guys tell me something about One Piece and I have to guess if it's true or not. Because <laughs> some of it is so crazy that I'd have no choice but to just accept and be like, uh, sure, that sounds real. I guess.
What is the typing of Extra Suica and Toho Puppet Dance Performance Shard of Dreams? Alcohol type. Gourd type. Blonde type. Rumble Ball is the drugs? Sounds about right. That sounds like a street drug. <laughs> it sounds like a recreational drug. Uh oh. Sorry, Hilda, do you not approve of recreational drugs? Meow? Okay. What are you doing? Come here, you wanna come say hi? Or you just wanna stare at my foot? Alright, that's fine too. Ah, sweet dog! Fake me out? Well, that was me imitating Hilda. She's like a little far from the microphone because she went rare, so I went rare? Questioningly. Make up something you think would be real plat. Oh, I'm sorry. What do you said? Make up something you think would be real, comma, plastic? I thought you were asking me to make up something I thought would be real plastic. And I was like, uh, like the plastic you get in real life? This guy has, like, got a place to go with only four toes. That's fine. Sorry, every answer was wrong. Extra Suica's fire water. Oh. Close enough. What is this little guy doing? There's somebody on the platform. Do you want to get it? Yeah. Yay! Oh, that's the thing I needed! Yay! Good news! Oh boy. Actually, fire water is an alcohol-related term, so yeah, I win. That means I win. Mika wins! Throw it up on the screen. <laughs> Mika wins. Would you rather go to the moon, a haunted house, the deep sea, prehistoric times, switch places with your pet, or a cosmic zoom? I'd rather switch places with my pet, because my cat just gets to sleep in crap in a box all day. And that sounds pretty nice. She doesn't have to pay taxes! Haha, <laughs> pet play? Alright, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Mika, did you hear about Crash Bandicoot 4? Um, yes? I had never played Crash Bandicoot. So... How efficient would Hilda be as you? Probably about as efficient as I already am. Actually, that's a lie. Hilda can get very f Well, I also can get very focused on things as long as I find them interesting. Good question. It might be about the same. Except she would be pumpkin motivated. I don't care so much about eating pumpkin. I don't know if I've told you guys this before. Um, Hilda's favorite food is pumpkin. I give, I started giving her pumpkin to- she was having a little digestive problems and one thing they recommend online and stuff a lot is to give your cat pumpkin. And I started giving it to her and it turns out it's like her favorite food and she goes absolutely crazy for it. And I give it to her about every other day, at least twice a week. And she goes insane every time. And I have to be like, don't eat so fast, you'll throw up. Don't eat so fast, you'll throw up. Because she's just like, hum, 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 hum. Every time I give her pumpkin. She thinks it's the most delicious thing ever. If I walk in, I give her like, I give her pumpkin in this little glass dish. If I walk in with a, the little glass dish in my hand, she like freaks out. She's like, oh my god, it's here. <laughs> like, I don't ever see her get that excited about food except for pumpkin. It's very cute. Like, it's her favorite thing. So basically, if Hilda had to be me for a day, people would just have to be like, Okay, Hilda, I need you to fill out all this paperwork, but if you do it, you'll get pumpkin. And she'll be like, Yes. You choose that over the chance of me to ghost or a dinosaur? Well, that could be life-threatening, depending on how it goes. But being Hilda all day, I mean, I get to just relax and crap in a box. See? Logic. I mean, a ghost might haunt me forever and a dinosaur might eat me. So... Morale.
Hilda, you want to come over here? I hear you crying over there. What's the matter? She probably wants pumpkin right now. Hilda, you want to come say hi? Or you want to say me? Come here. Hilda, you want a treat? I got treats right here for you, baby. Nope, she just wants to stare at me. When I say, do you want to come here and get a treat, she just looks at me like, no, are you stupid? Oh, cool. Awesome. Yeah, this is fine. Hilda also really likes tuna juice. But I don't eat canned tuna that often. But if you, like, have canned tuna... She loves if you give her the juice, but most cats do, I think. Yes, that's you! What's the matter? Are you coming over to say hi? Yeah? What's the matter? What's the matter? You want to cuddle me while I play Earthbound? Okay, you can cuddle me while I play Earthbound. You want to say hi to your adoring fans? Yeah? Hilda, you play in Earthbound? Who's your favorite character, Hilda? You like Paula? Blink once for Paula. Oh fuck, she's not blinking. I guess she doesn't like Paula. You guys want some good Hilda content? I'm gonna touch her butt. Ready? Hilda, I'm gonna touch your butt, okay? <laughs> Not like her butthole. But her butt. If you just pat like the side of her butt, she'll be like, meh. Right, Hilda? Oh my god, she you guys probably can't hear it, but she's purring. I guess she did really want to cuddle me. Did you just want to cuddle me? Did you just want to lick my hand? Hey, Dad. Not a good time. You want to talk to the zombie next to me? Sure have been out here for a long time now. Nah, I'm good. I gotta fight the zombie. Alright, Hilda, you wanna... You wanna play Earthbound? Oh, you wanna move? Okay, you can move. Oh my god, you guys, you know what? First of all, uh, you know what I got into recently that I don't remember if I told you? I started, uh, playing World of Warcraft. Uh, do, you, do any of you guys play it? Uh, would you be interested in watching me perhaps stream World of Warcraft sometime? I just think that would be cool. It's up to you guys, but I don't, I don't really know if I know people that are into that. If you guys aren't into it, it's fine. I just started playing it recently, and I like it. I remember when I, I uh, streamed Final Fantasy XIV, you guys liked that. A lot of you guys actually liked that. Um, I actually renewed my subscription to Final Fantasy XIV as well, and played that a bit. And, are you ready for this? I, I had to open up one of my old gmail accounts for something that I hadn't got into a long time and it was from like high school and um, I found out that's where my my Neopets account was linked to and <laughs> I got into my old Neopets so I, I've heard rumors that you can stream Neopets on Twitch and so I kind of wonder if if I would be in the okay to just like stream me playing like doing my dailies on Neopets um, And like doing the games and feeding my Neopets. It's not as good as it used to be. I can stream me checking my Neopets stocks, which I, I definitely do <laughs> I'm so bored of this come on now Hooray so I don't know if you'd be into that. I'm not personally into MMOs, but do what you please. Okay. I mean, that's fair. That's the kind of input I want to hear. It's like, I don't know how many of you guys 
are into MMOs or want to see me stream an MMO. World of Warcraft so far has been really chill and I've enjoyed it, so I think it would be cool to do a really chill stream of it. You know, one of those where we just kind of hang. Can I use the snake bag now? I'd be more for Neopets than WoW. Fair enough. If I can, I've heard it's okay. I can stream Neopets. Can show you guys my Neopets. My account is pretty old. I think I've had it since 2012. So I think it's an eight year old account, I'm pretty sure. So I have like the eight years shield. Um, I won't reveal it right now. But maybe on my stream I'll just be like, Hey guys, if you have Neopets accounts, add me as a Neo friend. <laughs> so I mean, if you guys want to get that started, I guess you could go make some- Hilda, where are you? I just heard you cry. Oh, you're behind me. What's up? Are you okay? Are you okay, Hilda? Oh, you want to nuzzle my iPad for some reason? She was like, eh? And I was like, are you okay? And she was just like, nuzzle, nuzzle, and she's nuzzling my iPad. For some reason. I don't really want to do that. I'd like to go- oh wait, I'm sorry. I'd like to- I just mixed two of the message chats together in my eyes. I, I'd watch you stream Neopets if you went to Jelly World. There's like nothing to do in Jelly World. There's like the jelly. Though, um, I suppose you can print out coloring pages. I lost the password to the Neopets account I made in like 2002. I wonder if I could somehow get back into it. I think most super old accounts that haven't been deleted, uh, like haven't been logged into in a long time, eventually do get phased out. You know what's something about that though? I had this old Neopets account where I begged and begged them to unfreeze my account because I was posting chain mail, because I was like eight, and they- I- I couldn't get into it, and I made a new account in like a fit of tears, and they unfroze it, and then I just checked on the account again, and now it's frozen again? Not sure what that was about. Maybe it's because it's old that they freeze old accounts now? But, yeah. <laughs> That's my sad childhood stories when I was like eight years old on Neopets, they had like chain mail. I was like, post this in the trading post and get a rainbow paintbrush in your inventory or some shit and get two million Neo points. And I was like, oh shit, dog. And so I did that and Neopets is like, don't post chain mail. And I was like, okay, I won't do it anymore. And like at the time I was doing this, the whole trading post in Neopets was all these posts that were just chain mail. They were like, post this and get three million Neo points. Send this Neo mail to 10 of your friends and get. 20 million Neo points, and I was like, oh, hell yeah, boy. And Neo Pets was like, you are super banned, asshole. And I cried. I cried in real life about it. Like, I was sitting in front of my computer as, like, an eight-year-old just crying. What's your guys' favorite Neo Pet? Mine is the, um, Aisha? Aisha? I think maybe it's just Aisha. They're like little alien dudes with antennas, and they kind of look like a cat with antennas on it and a little tiny body. Mine is the Acara. Oh, I know that one with the tendrils. It's kind of looks sort of, I don't know, weaselish. A little bit cat like as well. Very cute. They got big eyes. Wait, you could chat on Neopets? Yeah, but I think you had to put your age as like above 13 or something to send Neo Mail. If you put it below, you couldn't do Neo Mail like at all. <laughs> Because I know it asks for your age when you sign up. 
Scorchio, I think it's called. Oh yeah, the dragon guy. The one that's very, like, dragon-like. Because everyone's favorite was a uh, Shoryu? Shor Shoryu? Somewhere in the death of Mio Pets, there's like a pronunciation guide on how you're actually supposed to pronounce their names. Um... Oh. Well done! Thank you. You've made it! Thank you again. We finally meet Prince Kappa. Oh, he's here. Yes, him. This guy. The stars foretold I would meet you here. So now it's time for me to show you the way of the star storm. For a while, you must live far away from your friends and live with me. Do you understand? There's only one answer. I must stop you here if you don't want to. Stay with me a while. Do you understand? It's important that I stay and that I study and learn the star storm. It will be most helpful to us. Once I learn it, I'll meet up with you, Sans. Trust me. I'll see you again. It depends on Kappa's efforts. That will determine the reunited of the group. Be faithful and wait for until the time comes. Damn. He came and went so quick. Oh, I miss Pooh. Come back. I remember my older brother got so mad at me over the official pronunciation of the Lupus Neopet. Lupus? I don't think that's his name. Isn't it Loop? He's like a wolf guy. I remember Jellert as well. It's like a wolf dog with antenna. They should have a couple designs that are like, we put antenna on a creature. Hell yeah, key to the tower. Aw, oh, sick dog, a fight. There's so many I just don't- This guy just shows up, took poo, and left. True that. I get it, because it's also like, took a poo, haha. <laughs> Who has the Hawkeye? I swear to god, if Pooh has it, I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> I think he's mostly just carrying water. Hilda, shut up. Do you have to go to jail that badly right now? What am I even- I don't know what I picked up, but it seems that it should be something I keep. Well, I have two snake bags, so you know what? Fuck it. Is there not a failsafe for that? Let's see. Oh, it's okay. Jeff has it. We're fine. Even if there's not a fail safe, Jeff has it. Oh, shit. I should sell some of my stuff. Hey, Mika, who's the villain Usopp's introductory arc? Ah. Uh... Sanji, and then he has a change of heart, and he becomes everyone's friend. I made that up. It's probably not true. <laughs> I guess I'll get rid of this rock candy. I don't really need it. Nice. Nice. His name's Captain Crow, and he's got Wolverine claws. Aw, oh, that's dope! <laughs> I'm gonna have to wait for another customer this crazy heat. Ain't that the pits? Yeah, it also is the pits of this organization system, and this game is absolute fucking nonsense, and I hate it. Hilda! Okay, hold on. I have to put Hilda in jail. Just give me one minute. Hilda! Hilda! What is your problem? Okay, shh. Okay, okay. We're going. We're going. Okay, wait, I never even found out what the Pharaoh's curse does. Hilda is a cat. This is true. I think my favorite Neopet was the walkie. Oh yeah, the one that's like, it's got like fluff around its neck. And it's fluffy. <laughs> um, does anyone like Cybunnies? 
CY bunnies? C bunnies? Cy bunnies? They're basically just a fucking rabbit. <laughs> they basically are like, it's a rabbit. <laughs> That's about it. Oh man, I have so much bullshit. I don't need any of this. I guess I don't need this. Alright. Is this better than the weapon he has now? I guess it must be. Ooh, yes. Do you have room for this? No, you don't. Of course you don't. But I want it. Oh, okay. Cool. He's just like, sorry, I'm not buying that from you. Die. What's the name of the moonwalking dude who works with Kudo? Uh... Tsuki... Chiro. <laughs> I'm gonna go with either Tsuki or Chiro. <laughs> Why do you know so much about One Piece? Me? Oh, I'm just a genius, so to speak. Son of a bitch. Do you buy anything? I guess I can get rid of one of these vials of serum. Just for this case. Because I want a multi-bottle rocket from this guy. I was referring to Blue Man Chew. Listen, I'm funny. Beef jerky. His name is Django. He's got heart-shaped glasses and can hypnotize people with chakrams. That sounds cool. Isn't there a Mega Man character named Django? In the X series? Which one is he from? I genuinely don't remember. I might be tweaking. Was he in Command Mission? I think he was in Command Mission. His name is like... Jungle? Django. I don't remember. <laughs> Maybe I should replay Command Mission. Great, awesome, sweet, dope. I don't have any wet towels, do I? Probably not. Aw, oh, a can of fruit juice! Lovely. What is the name of Rosalon's patron troll? Oh, son of a bitch, Jesus. Uh, girl! <laughs> Wait. Oh. Who, who is- why are you asking me about Homestuck? I honestly don't remember. <laughs> I seriously don't remember! <laughs> What's the last time I had to talk about Homestuck? Oh my fucking god. Hello! Sir- Oh, Kanaya! Jesus Christ. I was like the one with the like, pointy- She's got the swirl and the black lipstick and the teeth and the like, hair that's sort of like positioned constantly upward. Yeah, I remember that she's the Virgo one. I- that's what- Girl? I, was, I really didn't remember. Yeah, Kanaya. I remember- She's the one who talks- She's the one who talks in her quirk is that all of her words are capitalized at the beginning, right? Did you know that DJ Polly D types this way? <laughs> it looks like you could enter, but it's locked. Is that where I use the tower key then that I have? Who's holding it? Key to the tower. Where did we enter this? This is off topic, but did you ever see the Kamida I built on the Minecraft server way back when? No! 
You what? You made Kamida? Uh, welcome. You are inside of my body. I believe the sample here is just someone saying, where's my woman? Excellent. I just built a full Komida sprite. That's... That's wonderful. That's beautiful. Am I being attacked by present boxes? Oh man, I might need to tie up this stream soon. Is that a coffee cup full of ketchup? Oh man. I'm too old. <laughs> All my bones are breaking. So that was weird. Oh, is that what it is? It's blood coffee? It's not ketchup? I like to pretend it's a cup of ketchup someone wanted to drink. Um, if you check into this batch, it's just like checking into a hotel. Is this game okay? Hey Mika, what is the calm belt in One Piece? Uh, there's no waves there. Ocean's calm. I just want to talk to my mom. Can hardly hear you. It sounds like you're calling from the moon or something. If you're doing okay, that's great. Listen, I have to get going. I'm trying to give Hilda a flea bath. Thank you, Mom. That's very comforting to hear. Oh, boy. I... Yeah. Okay. It has been a two-hour and 10 minute stream. I usually would take a break. I have not by now. I have not taken any break this stream. So I will be back on Wednesday <laughs> with more Earthbound as I am tired and this dungeon is like drilling into my ears and eyeballs at once. It's a lot. <laughs> so thank you so much for coming to the stream. I will be back on Wednesday. Remember to check out my YouTube VOD channel where you can watch my VODs. I know a lot of you have been doing that. That's great. Uh, keep keep it coming. I did notice it got some uh, followers on there, which is really cool. Remember, you can uh, follow me on Twitter, especially because lately I like to post screen caps from my Switch on there. So if you want to see that, that's sort of fun. I have some Animal Crossing patterns on there as well. Besides following my Twitter just for like when I'm streaming, um, I don't do social media a whole lot. But when I do, I try to make it worthwhile. So I I have some Animal Crossing patterns on there. If you like Raven Vesperia, I made a Raven pattern. <laughs> where you can dress up as Raven and Animal Crossing if you want. Otherwise, make sure to follow the Games Are Painted Twitter and join the Games Are Painted Discord so you can get notifications whenever any of us are streaming or just reach out to us when you want to talk about our streams or just, you know, hit us up on the Discord or Twitter. Uh, again, I'll be back Wednesday. Planning to play more Earthbound. Hope to see you then. I love you guys. Bye-bye.